everyone and welcome back to Mary Steals and Steals and welcome back to another 5 off of 25 for Saturday, January the 25th. Now, I'm going to share with you a couple of scenarios for Saturday and this will give you an idea of what and how much you can save with that $5 off that we get. And in addition, utilize those digital coupons. Combine all those together and your out-of-pocket will be tremendously low. But before I get started, I wanted to share with you some of the Christmas items that I was able to pick up for 25 cents. Hey everyone, so if you saw my past video, I was able to share with you the items like paper plates, some containers. What else did I pick up? Oh, of course, our regular typical Christmas items, which was the Christmas bags, Christmas boxes. But if I was you, look through your store. I know that all the air fresheners that are Christmas scented or fall scented are reduced to 25 cents. Candles, foil, and as you see here, the parchment paper. Whatever you do, walk through your store, utilize your Dollar General app to scan those products. All you have to do is scan the barcodes with that app and you should be able to find out if it's going to be one of your 25 cent items. I was able to go back today because yesterday my store was not ringing up the items correctly. But as you see here, the parchment paper, I saw it on the top of the aisles and I was able to bring those down and I scanned them and they did scan for 25 cents. So anything that you just suspect that is part of the Christmas, Take a look at it, scan it. It's worth you giving it a try. So if you didn't see my past video of small amounts of items that I picked up, it'll give you an idea. Take a look at it. It'll give you an idea of what is marked down. And like I said here, the parchment paper. Take a look at other YouTubers. Take a look at Facebook um, or Instagram. And you're able to see other items that are also reduced or clearanced out on the Christmas I guess items or sale that they're having like I said they're 25 cent items now this is probably not the lowest it's gonna go but I guarantee you, you're not gonna find anything after this week uh, at 25 cents so without further ado let's go ahead and get started on my 5 off of 25 scenarios that I wanted to share with you now before I go on to show you scenario number one I just want to make sure that you clip your 5 off of 25 digital coupon along with any other digitals that you will be using at the register. So let's go ahead and get started on scenario number one. Okay, so you're gonna pick up two of the L'Oreal products for $4 each. You'll pick up your Nivea lotion for $4.15. Now in my region, that is the price that we have them at. If they're lower or higher in your area, just adjust your math accordingly. Now you'll pick up two of the Nivea lip balms for $2 each, equaling $4 one of the chic razors of your choice now you can pick the men's or the woman these are four dollars and fifty cents and we just got that three dollar digital that came into our account on sunday you'll pick up your userin for four dollars and fifty cents and again i'm including the prices in my area if they're different in yours adjust your math accordingly the total before any digital coupons and your five off of 25 before they're applied is 25 dollars and 15 cents Okay, so here's a rundown of all the digitals that you will need for this scenario. You'll need your $2 off, your $3 off, I apologize, for two of the L'Oreal products, your $2 off for your Nivea, your $2 off for your Nivea lip balm, and the $3 off, of course, for your Chic razors, your $3 off for your user and lotion, and don't forget your five off of 25. After everything is applied, your out-of-pocket for this scenario is going to be $7.15. Okay, the next scenario is going to be a very low out of pocket, and it also might include a lot of the digital coupons you have used. If you do not have any of these digitals available, just move things around or improvise and put other items in that spot. But of those of you who have several accounts, I know I do. I've got every one of my children, which I have three children, and they allow me to use their account. So a lot of my accounts still have not been utilized for these particular digital coupons. So I wanted to share a low out of pocket for you as well. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, for scenario number two, I'm going to go ahead and tell you that I did not picture the crest on here, but I will show it the digital coupon that you will need. So I apologize for that. I noticed it after I had already posted it. So let's go ahead and get started. 
For this particular scenario number two, you'll pick up your Lysol for a dollar, your discreet liners for three dollars, the Tylenol that we have by the register for two dollars, your Crest toothpaste in the dollar aisle, your Schick razors for four dollars and fifty cents, your Bic razors for two dollars and eighty-five cents, your Alka-Seltzer tablets. These are by the register. They are a dollar and fifty cents a bag, and of course your Airwick. Um, product for $10. Now before any coupons are applied, your total will be $25.85. Let's take a look at all the digitals that we're going to apply and how much out of pocket we'll be paying. Okay, for the first digital, you're going to need your 50 cents off any Lysol brand product. You'll need your $2 discrete liner, your $2 for your Tylenols, your $1 for your Crest, your $3 for your Schick razor, your $3 for your Bic razors, and your $1 for your Alka-Seltzer product that is by the register, as I want to stress that out, and your $5 off for any one Airwick. Now, after all these digitals are applied, your out-of-pocket and your five off of 25 will be $3.35. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on to my last scenario that I want to share with you. And again, if you don't have certain digitals and that you have already used them, just kind of Pick and choose some other ones that you might have in your account that will make your out-of-pocket a lot less. And also think about the things that you need in your household. So for the last scenario, we're going to pick up our Scott's paper towels that are in the ad for $5. We'll pick up the Tide detergent for $4.95. The Schick razors for $4.50. Your Gain detergent or pods for $3.95. Your Gain softener or Gain sheets or the game beads, $3.95. You'll pick out one of those and your discrete liners for $3. Once everything is added up and before any digital coupons are applied, your total is $25.35. Okay, so here are all the digitals that you would need for this scenario. Your $1 for your Scots, your $2 for your Tide, your $3 for your Schick razors, your $1 for your Gain softener products of your choice, your $1 for your Gain Flings or Gain Pods, Gain Detergent, and your $2 for your Discreet Liners. Your out-of-pocket after your 5 off of 25 and all of these digitals are applied is $10.35. Now keep in mind that there is also that digital for when you spend 30 on Gain Scented Products. You can save an additional $5 and if that 5 off of 25 and the 5 off of 35 work in conjunction together, you can score some pretty good gain scented products. So these are my five off of 25 scenarios that I wanted to share with you. If you have any comments or questions, please drop them down below. I'm sorry this video is a little bit longer, but I just wanted to also share with you those 25 cent items that I did pick up at Dollar General today. And if you didn't see the video from yesterday, take a look at it. Also, I might be coming back and sharing with you maybe one scenario for that 5 off of 30 and the 5 off of 25. The only thing is I'm not sure it's going to work. That's a gamble that you take on Saturday morning. So I don't want to keep you all any longer. I want to thank you guys for stopping by. And as always, we'll see you on the next one.